Hey guys and welcome to Monkey Fish channel. In this video I spar Michael from the Dragon channel and we sparring in his home dojo which I helped him to make. So I just finished putting the floor here and we decided to try it out. So this is a light contact sparring with a lot of control and yeah we're just going to have a fun. So he asked me if I can fight in the orthodox stance because he was preparing himself for fight and yeah I, I tried my best to keep standing in this position but many times I have problems because you know I was naturally come back to my normal stance. This uh, kick I stole from my wife she liked to throw this kick and I feel like it's kind of cool to do this hook kick and here you could see that the mat uh, he has some problem with the mat but I feel it's really fast. So we come back to the sparring. As you can see, that every time I want I want to come back to my normal stance because normally I like to fight with my right leg in the front because of my Wing Chun background and of course judo. And actually I did not train any striking for almost two years, but Michael asked me to do this sparring because he was preparing himself for this fight so I say yes and also I didn't want to get too rusty so if I can spar with my friends and do some striking then normally I do if I remember correct uh, I think my toe in my left foot was broken that day because I was shooting one video and when I did a spinning kick my small toe go between tatami mats and this is how I broke it. It's really not nice but sometimes it happens and you know you cannot do anything about it. Okay so the round is over and in the second round I can fight how I want it so yes I will be more in my normal stance. Okay so the second round we go a little bit quicker, still with light contact, a lot of control and also because it's my normal stand so it was more comfortable for me. You have to remember that we're fighting in the house so we have to look out for everything around so we don't destroy anything. And here I throw one of my favorite taekwondo kicks, it's a Pitro Chagi. And right after that I throw the kick what I stole from my wife, this karate kick. And here Michael kicked me in the liver and this is a backside of standing in the south part position because you exposing the liver, it's really easy to get kicked over there. So I needed a little bit of time for myself to get back. And yeah, we are back now. I think that after the steeper kick, Michael gets a little bit more confident, so he uh, gets more aggressive. Maybe not aggressive, but more active in this round. He throw more combos and try to press me, so I start pressing him back. And yeah, we still keep uh, the safe, and this is light contact because you know we are in the in the home dojo. As you can see, Michael likes to throw a high kick and it's really easy for him because he's really flexible. And here I start to press him a little bit, I turn on my tank mode and just press, 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 just to see how he can do it in this kind of situation. But he did okay. He separated us by his side kick. Then we slow down again and come back to the control and light sparring. Before that he kicked me with his knee to my head but he didn't, I catch his leg and this was it. He tried the superman punch but he didn't connect it. So slowly going to the end and I don't think anything interesting happened to the end of this round so 
yeah, I would just say thank you for watching and see you next time guys.